hurt. I just hit my toe. Hey, what's up, you guys? It's Emily. So, um, I feel really far back from the camera right now, but I'm pretty far back for a reason. That is because today's video is going to be a thrift haul. Two days ago on Wednesday, I went thrifting with Hannah, and when I tell you that you're successful, by far my most successful thrifting trip i've ever been on and like a lot of time my friends will be like how do you find so much good stuff thrifting like i you need to i need to come or you need to take me or something but like it's not even that i just look through every single little thing and you can't just expect to go one time and find a lot of good stuff like it like obviously takes time to go which obviously there's a lot of thrifting videos on youtube if you guys have watched them so like you know that but anyways um so i'm gonna go ahead and get into the haul but i have a, i have like a lot and also a couple things i got i'm going on a mission trip next week so i got like um because i'm not supposed to wear like any tight pants or anything like that so i got some like bigger like mom jeans things like that to wear for that things like that i've said that like 50 times i'm sorry thanks joy this is gonna be a try on haul did i say that i didn't say that i don't think but i'm not filming the try on portion right now because you know we're gonna go take my dog somewhere after this so but i'll just go ahead and show you guys this since it's on me right now yeah i just watched the clip of me um showing you guys this and i just talk so unbelievably fast it hurts my brain sometimes and like when i'm doing it i don't realize it which i do all the time but then when i rewatch it i can barely understand myself which you know that's bad so i'm just gonna sorry if the intro is super super fast and i'm probably you guys should probably get used to me talking fast by now because it just happens i'm just gonna show you guys this one more time because i was talking way too fast but the first thing in this haul is just this denim men's like um button up pullover and i'll show you pullover it's not a pullover i'm i'm foggy brain right now guys i'm sorry so it's this denim men's button up and it's like in an extra large it's, i've been looking for one of these for so long when i tell you so long like i mean so long and my friend hannah she has one and it's super cute and she, you can just wear it over like anything literally like i'm wearing a tank top right now and this is like you know when in middle school like cardigans were a thing to wear and um like and for my middle school at least there was a dress code and stuff or even like freshman and sophomore year for me, um, I wore cardigans over so many tank tops. And, like, it's not that I won't anymore. Like, I still have cardigans. It's just, it's not really, like, my style anymore. And, well, that's really when I didn't have a style. <laughs> now I kind of do, so it just changed. But um, this, like, for, to me, it's just a lot cuter to put over, like, a tank top if you want to wear it to school. And I just wore leggings with it today. So I'm just really happy about this because I've been looking for one for so long. So it just shows, like, patience comes with thrifting. You know what I'm saying? You're not going to find something every single time. Got expect if you expect the worst, then you'll be surprised by anything, you know. And I'm sorry, I'm in a spinny chair right now, so I'm like, keep swiveling it around. Okay, so the next thing I got is by far. Should I say the best for last? I I just kind of I'm too excited. I just want to show you guys now. If you um if you're any of my friends watching this, then I 100% already told you this because I was so excited about it and literally told every single person at school today about it. So I'm sorry for being annoying about that, but it's by far the best thing I've ever found thrifting. So I. <laughs> I have been wanting to get like boots for a while now like cute boots when I go on my mission trip We're gonna be walking around a lot and stuff So it's like it'd be nice to have boots But I'm not gonna spend like a ton of money on that just for that So I go to Goodwill and I'm not a type of person to get shoes like thrifted like obviously you can like secondhand I'm just not one who normally does that like I normally look at clothes specifically I've gotten like a purse before and stuff and like a belt things like that like accessories But I've never gotten shoes and I'm looking around and I see in the display counter some boots and I'm like Hannah like I'm like Hannah look at those and she's like those you know like you know you see your shoe size and you're like you have that feeling it's your suit shoe size it was that kind of feeling she's like ask the lady the size and I'm like should I she's like obviously I failed to mention they were Timberlands so I'm like those are Tim those are Timberlands like I want some and I'm like are they in good condition I have no idea so I already had so much stuff like to, that I was gonna check out that I really need to put up some stuff because I don't have like money to be spending on clothes right now and which obviously it's better than like spending it at the store but still and so I asked the lady to check what size it is. It's a size 8. And I'm like, and you know they're in good condition and nice and stuff whenever they're in like the display counter. Like she has to get them out for me. And I'm like, she's like, they're size 8. Would you want to try them on? I'm like, they're literally my size. Like, is this meant to be? So she pulls out the shoes. I put, I look at them. They're literally in such good condition. It's ridiculous. I'm like, who would drop this off at Goodwill? You could sell these and make money off these. And I look, before I even tried them on, I looked at the tag. And they were $30 like at Goodwill, which they're, they're normally $130. And the woman, the lady's like, that color, like, tag, whatever thing is 40% off today. I'm like, so I got them for, what's the math, $16? I'm pretty sure it's what I've been telling people I got them for $16. But are you ready to see? Like, they're in such good condition. Like, I cannot, I'm so excited about it. But I wore them to school today with this, and this, and the leggings, and the boots. And it was a look. I'll show you guys in the try on hold up. But are you ready? The moment of truth. Here's my Timberlands. I love them so much. <laughs> Q's music. Look how beautiful. This is definitely going to be the thumbnail. Like, okay, they're just... Who would bring these to Goodwill? I don't understand. The literal only dirt on them is on the back. Like, you see there's some dirt right there. Not a big deal. There's, like, one scratch right there on the side. Um, 
there's a, a slight crease in the front but I, they they could not have been worn more than like five times like honestly not even the bottoms are clean like you know what i'm saying boots would be dirty on the bottom they're not even dirty but these are my babies i'm obsessed with them they're beautiful i've got the little cute little timberland thing on the side and I'm, they're not like fake like look at the timberland logo got the money on it um yeah can't you just imagine like isn't that a cute fit i'll show you guys it and um try on though but okay now that i obsess over my timberlands to y'all i'm gonna get into like the other clothes besides what i'm wearing right now so there's so much to get into i guess I'll, i'm gonna do pants first how about that i got a heck of a load of pants right now <gasps> oh here's something else i'm gonna start oh i have another pair in my closet i didn't get Ooh, another thing that i've been looking for for a really long time thrifting is corduroy pants i've been really wanting some but i don't want to spend 50 dollars on like some cute ones you know what i'm saying i found two pairs of corduroy pants so the first pair i'll just do like this pair is like not my favorite pair the other pair i like more um Oh, well, you guys have seen them. I'm stupid. The one, the quarter, it was a sneak peek. I showed you guys in the last video. I was so excited about my red quarter pants that I wore in the Christmas video. Yeah, those are them. But anyway, so these pair I got, um, this is just like the regular quarter color. I think I'd like, like it if it's a little bit darker, but they're Levi's and they're like super nice. They fit me so good. And whenever I roll them, they're really cute. But yeah, they're just high-waisted uh, quarter Levi's. So I got those and then we're going to throw it. And then... I have my, I still feel like this frame isn't big enough for this. Then I have my red corduroys that I'm literally obsessed with. They're so cute. I haven't worn them yet to school. Maybe I'll wear them next week. But there's, oh, one's rolled, one's not. But I literally am obsessed with them. And I look like either Marina Sings or Clown in them. But I'm okay with that because they're so cute. I'm going to throw that. Okay, I'm trying to go through this quick, honestly, because I have so much. Okay, the next pants, I got these yesterday, um, or Wednesday, whatever. They're from Forever 21, which I didn't realize until I got home. But I love them. I can wear these in, like, Guatemala, too, for, like, when I'm dressing nice for dinner and stuff. Um, but look, they are, these just, like, long, obviously. They're, like, actually a little short. They're kind of cropped. But they're just black in, like, a brownish, goldish, white stripe kind of pattern. And they have these cute little, like, boho-looking strings. Um, and then the back, the back's cute too. Look at the little pockets. I love them. So I'm definitely, those are a cute a find as well. So then this is a skirt. I got this for Halloween because again, it's from Forever 21. That's kind of funny, but I saw the tag sticking out and I was like tags, you know, I was going to check what tags on it. Cause who gets new stuff to Goodwill? I don't know. I don't know. I'm not the person who brings that. I'm the person who buys it. But anyways, for Halloween, I was going to be a vampire and I was looking for something. And even if I was like, even if I'm not one this year, Th this for future years would be so good and I saw this little pleather skirt sticking out and I would never wear this like it normally actually it looks really wrinkly but like do you see how glossy that is what the heck but it's this little pleather skirt okay it's from forever 21 it's brand new with tags on it it was originally $20 at forever 21 then they had it on sale at forever 21 for $10 then I got it for $4 at Goodwill so like that is a snag so in the future hopefully I'll wear this for something because it's cute like it's new too like what do you mean so I have two more pairs of pants to show you guys and these are both jeans um these i got specifically for my mission trip because you know it's like good to be working in when i'm outside and things jeans is like a good material to wear one of these are super long so i'm gonna have to trim the bottom before i try them on or roll them or something so i'll show you guys but this is the first pair this is um i don't even i don't know how to say that is eddie eddie bot is it eddie buyer i think it's eddie buyer eddie bow bower eddie buyer i think it's eddie. okay but these are one of those things, whenever you're looking for jeans thrifting, like, you cannot look at size, like, a brand, anything like that. Because there could be, it couldn't even have a brand on it. And it could be, say, it's a size 12 and it'd fit you, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, this is a, it's a size 8 and I'm not a size 8 and they fit me good. So, um, it's a really pretty wash. Like, this looks like it'd be a brand new level, you know what I'm saying? Like, can't you tell by the butt? It's just really pretty high-waisted jeans. Um, so those are those. I'll show you them in the trial portion, what they look like on me. So those are good ones that I like a lot. And then I also got this pair, which they both are a light wash pair. I actually had to put a pair of jeans back that I liked because I didn't, I, I couldn't spend like a ton of money, like a goodwill. Well, I could have, but I just don't have the money to spend. These are also Levi's. Um, it says they're low straight, but they're, I don't know what it means by that because they're not. These are the Levi 505s. These are super cute as well. Love them. I always love a good Levi. <laughs> I'm talking so fast i'm sorry but that is every that is all the pants like bottom things that i got and i'm going to show you guys all of my tops and jackets and things like that let's get in um i'm sorry that i'm talking to you guys like your dogs or something i'm literally like let's get in like uh, okay in my um go thrifting with me video i showed you guys this which is just like this off the shoulder red burnt orange fall looking top which i love i actually still haven't worn this yet but it's super cute then I showed you guys this shirt, which this is really wrinkly because it's dirty right now. But it's just the mustard yellow, um, like, rib top. And I told you guys I was going to crop this. But then when I've worn it, like, twice already. And both times I wore I just tied it up because I didn't, I hadn't cropped it yet. And I really like it tied up. So I don't know if I'm going to cut it or not. We'll see. 
and then I showed you guys this which this is literally this was my biggest like find before my shoes that I found because this is O'Neal like a nice brand and it's um the army it's like a cinched army jacket if you didn't watch my other video I probably should still show it to you guys but um it's so cute like the detailing is so cute and this has a little gold tassel then the buttons and then I wore it with like black jeans and then I like buttoned one of the buttons and cinched it around my waist and then wore did I wear boots? I don't know what shoes I wore, but it was a really cute outfit. Before I continue, my mom got these um, gingerbread cookies. Well, she made them. It's like the cookie that they sell at Trader Joe's, and they are so good. I shouldn't. I don't need to be eating this. Tastes like Christmas. So then I found um, this sweater, which I've worn this multiple times too. I love it. Um, but it's just. I showed you guys it already in the video if you saw it, but it's just the cropped, it's from Gap, I think, but navy blue sweater, super cute for fall. Oh, the arm's tucked in, but I really like this. I've worn it a couple times already. Okay, I'm going to show you guys the top that I already cropped and the ones that I haven't cropped yet, but I'm planning on cropping so you know. When I first bought this, it, this was a this is within the little boy section. It's an extra large, and when I first bought it, like, it was, when I say it was so ugly and boyish looking, like, it was straight, like, boy, I was like, my mom's going to get mad at me for getting this. Um, but I cropped it and I love it. Like I've, I've worn it once, but I was wearing it in the Christmas video. Oh my gosh, this, I already was wearing everything, but, um, it's just this green and navy blue and like, I don't even know what color that is, tan and like white striped top. And I cropped it like pretty short, but it's the perfect length for some of my, um, black mom jeans that I have, but I love the shirt and it's so cute now and it's like thick. So it's like a good long sleeve. And I'm planning on doing that with both of these shirts. So keep that in mind when I show you it because it's it's so ugly right now, and I'm hoping it's not gonna be. But it's again, it's a kids ex it's a kids or boys extra large. But this is just a orange and gray striped one. But it literally, do you see how ugly this looks? This thing is so long. But I'm gonna crop it and I'll show you guys what it looks like after for the try on. And then I'm also doing that for this one. This is just literally a black like uh what's it called? It's like the waffle pattern. What are they called? Uh, ther thermals. It's like a black thermal. But again, super just like long, not cute. And when I crop it, hopefully it'll be cute. Kind of thermal. I think this is my last thing. It is just this. It's again, what's that brand called? Eddie, Eddie bought buyer, but I don't know. But this is a large, so I think it's just a woman's large, but um, or it might be a man's. I don't really know what section I got this in, but I wish you guys could feel this with the camera. It is so soft. Like it's just this really nice like material, you know what I'm saying? And then it's lined with like cotton. And you can just tell it's like high quality, but um, I'm gonna wear this. I mean, I'm gonna wear it regular, regular too, but like I'm gonna bring it on my mission trip because it'll be a good jacket to have. Okay, so that is everything for this thrift haul. I don't know if I should have showed you guys everything or not. I feel like I didn't. I'm probably gonna do the try on portion after this and like a mini lookbook with everything so you can see what everything looks like on. I'm just popping in real quick to tell you guys that I decided I'm just gonna make a separate um, thrifted lookbook video because I've been wanting to make one soon anyway, so why would I put it at the end of the video that's already pretty long? When I could just put it in other videos. Yeah, if you want to see that video, it's going to be coming out in the next couple of days, hopefully. Now you guys can just get back to the outro of this video. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Why do I feel like putting on setting spray? We're just going to put on some setting spray. James Charles. I need a fan. Should I buy his sister's, like, limited edition fan? I kind of want to. But yeah, I hope you guys like this video. And if you did, don't forget to like it and subscribe and comment down below if you've got any video requests or if you want me to do any more thrifting videos. And I will see you guys next time.